My name is Savannah, and this is Colby. And welcome to today's episode with Chess Tips with Colby. Today we are going to give the def some defense strategies in chess. Let's get started. What's the first strategy? The first strategy we're going to do is a very simple one to where you just move one of these pieces. You move one of your pawns, two squares forward, and then your opponent would go, depending on what they did. So let's say they moved forward this piece, hypothetically, and then you could move this piece forward. Now, this piece is not in danger, at least not yet. So, to protect it, you would take out your knight and move it in the L shape to the left, causing it to then, if it was going to attack, it would be protecting right there, or right here for other pieces too. So, this means that if something would try and Let's say this pawn moved forward, and then you moved this pawn there. They try and take this pawn, then this they could take that piece. So, yeah, it protects it and makes sure that it will be safe. What's your last strategy? My last strategy is going to involve using the bishop. So, first you would move this pawn right here, or you can move it to that space. It doesn't matter. You just need a nuclear space for your bishop. Then they would go, they could move a piece right here. Then you need to move, if you move this piece, and let's say you move it right there. Then, let's say your opponent moved a pawn to this area. Your, they c would not attack this way because it's protected. However, since we did move this piece there, it, is, it does leave a vulnerable spot. So there is a flaw to moving it to right there, but you could actually leave it right here, making it less vulnerable. But otherwise, this pawn is safe. Now that we have learned some of the defense strategies, which was the hardest? I think the hardest would be trying to get your rook to protect other pieces, since it can be easily taken by many other pieces, <coughs> depending on its placement. Which strat strategy was the easiest? The easiest strategy is when you just move your knight to protect pawns, which ended up getting to around in this area, because it's just simple to protect them from the L shape. Okay. Which strategy was your favorite? My strategy, that the strategy I think it, that is my favorite, is the easiest one. I use it a lot in the beginning of games, so that way I have more protected pieces and can get further. Thank you for watching. This show is hosted by A&N Digital Technologies.